The first humans arrived less than a thousand years ago from other islands of the South Pacific. According to the legend, the first Maori explorer to visit the islands was named Kupe. Supposedly, he landed on Northland and made his way around the islands. He went home telling his people of this promising new land, and several generations later, there was a mass migration of Maori to New Zealand. They survived by fishing, growing vegetables, and hunting local birds. Over the centuries, there was conflict over land between different tribes, but no particular group dominated. Like other people in the South Pacific, the Maori had a warrior, warrior culture. James Cook came to New Zealand in 1769, and after a few Maori were killed, relations between the Europeans and Maori improved. They began trading, and eventually missionaries settled on the islands. They learned the language, created a writing system, and converted some Maori to their religion. However, the European influence was not significant until the British government declared New Zealand an official colony in 1840. The Treaty of Watanagi was signed by the Queen's representatives and the various chiefs of Maori tribes. However, the translation was not sufficient, and this led to wars over land. The Maori eventually reduced their aggression due to the impressive number of British soldiers and their artillery. Legal battles over land still continue today.